Kai. I'm Kai. But Krauss thing you can forget. I'm just, I'm just Kai. I'm just trying to touch your soul. And in that sense, what I'm now working for is the mixture of the mathematics, the interfaces, the, the what you can do on a computer that you never could do before on a canvas or any other medium. And that really intrigues me, is to, to get to the edge of what's doable, and that the people now may be the very, very first ones ever to explore that edge of the space. It's awkward. I was. Three, four years ago, I was one of the very first ones to get on this high horse and go, the web is coming, the web is coming. And people are talking, like, you know, where's the spider? They didn't know what the hell I was talking about. And I'm ready to throw in the towel. You know, I'm this close to committing cybercide. It's just too much. I mean, every yachts under a rock now has, I mean, you drive by a gas station, it's got its own web page. Every chair in a restaurant has got its own web page. It's gotten to a, dil a dilution effect where it becomes almost meaningless. And all I'm trying to do there is just get them at 2 in the morning to sit in front of the machine going, what the hell is that? You know, and go, yo, Fred, check, check this out. Look what I did. Like, I did that here. Come over here. I, I got something else. That's the moment I live for. Whether they then use it every day and whether they do incredible art with it or whether they can do it in production environment every day and it does every last little CMYK conversion thing, I'm afraid at this point I can't really, can't really worry about that. So that ticks off a few of the professional people. But... I'm afraid I'm going to have to bite into that bullet. On the other hand, it'll make a lot more friends at the other end. As in Japan, a guy comes up to me and says, you filters, they are like a bad hairpiece. And I go, what the fuck is he talking about, you know? It's like, you know, I'm losing my hair slowly, I'm giving it to my sons, but that wasn't what he was trying to say. He was trying to say that you only see bad hairpieces. If it's a really good hairpiece, you don't see it, because it's a really good hairpiece. So if it's a mediocre hairpiece, you can spot it from a mile away. So I see all these uses of KPT all the time when you go, oh, look, it's another psychedelic thing over there. But when you watch MTV and there's little tiny backgrounds flimmering, or you look at the TV guide and the layers on the cover of the front of it is done with KPT, or the Academy Awards and all the golden shimmering letters are done with KPT, people usually don't associate that with it because they wouldn't know. No, I, I can tell them because my, my babies, I can tell the colors from a mile away. I must say, in, in another sense, we've, we've really painted ourselves in a corner. I'm actually, at the same time, exhilarated by how much has happened and deeply disgusted that we've had 10 years of eight character file names and we've really, really ended up with some incredibly mediocre state that all has to go. I mean, almost everything we look at right now, every piece of software being sold at the near, nearest egghead, from Word to Excel to anything you can name, it's all antique. It's seven, eight years old and be repackaged and regurgitated. It's all got to go, including all my own stuff. So somebody has to start with a clean new canvas and say, look, you got a gigabyte disk, you got a megabyte of RAM or 10 or 50 megabytes of RAM, you got a million pixels. Let's do something fresh and different and new.